As you get older, your body changes, your attitude changes, your friends change, you lose friends, you gain friends. Hey, I've I've heard of that happen to many people before. Trust me. It even happened in sixth grade, which is the grade I'm graduating from. What's up dudes and dudes? It's your girl KKTC here and today we're talking about I'm saying goodbye to elementary school. Yep. Goodbye to your naps and playing in dirt for no reason and hello growing up in middle school and people getting shoved into lockers and is that is that happen? Like is, I'm just saying that's like every stereotype of people going to I'm sorry, it does like the wrong thing, but anyways. And welcome that back to some more Fortnite Battle Royale <laughs> Um commentary. Um so like I was saying, uh, you grow up, you change, yeah, everybody knows the word for that, if you don't, then, well, you might want to stay yourself and not grow up and learn what those words are, I'm joking, you got to learn them either way, so might as well learn, it's called puberty, um, so you go through that change and then your attitude changes then you lose friends and then blah 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 nobody gives a crap um so me saying goodbye to 4k through sixth grade of my elementary school it's sad but i'm ready at the same time not ready to get like shoved in lockers and be called a fool or anything but ready to step up and be, you know what, forget all this, like, oh, it's gonna be okay when you grow up, talk, let's just get to this right now, the point, you gonna have, you gonna be struggling AF whenever you first get to middle school or high school or wherever the freak you going, you're gonna squ struggle, and it happens to everybody, okay, just because I've been to one school, period, all my life so far, does that mean I can I am perfect and don't struggle whatsoever. Yeah, everybody struggles. That's part of life. I mean, hello. <laughs> Look at yourself right now. You ain't telling me that you. St <sighs> yeah, you get my you get my drift. Um. So that's that. So my first grade which is 4k at my school which is like the first grade ever in elementary school um i actually had fun and believe it or not because well we used in 4k we d we took naps we talked about people i'm joking we used too young for that we took naps <laughs> um we played outside for like a long period of time we uh we ate lunch um yeah you know basically anything and me at that time was actually like chill what i mean my dad was like i was shy <laughs> like i was like i was the shyest person in 4k i'm pretty sure i wouldn't talk to nobody i would be like just like this loner at recess who just like sit on the bench or sit like in the grass or something and just like pick at like bugs or something or ants until I get bit like I was that person and I didn't mind it actually I mean yeah I played like tag or duck duck goose like every once in a while at recess but I wasn't like Oh yeah, let's go. Well, boom. I wasn't the talkative person in the game. I usually just like sat back, relaxed, and if somebody argued or something like that, I would just be like, "Yeah, I'm just." Cause I'm that person, you know. I don't really, I don't choose sides. Like I hate choosing sides, believe it or not. So if you tell me to choose sides, I'm gonna be like, "Huh, no." <laughs> Cause like I am not the person who choose sides. Not, not in an argument, not in drama, not in nothing. Like, there's currently drama going on right now. In my life right now. Like, over social media and over... Yeah. And... 
I I'm kind of in the middle of it. I mean, I don't have no beef between the two people or anybody. I just don't like choose the sides or defending nobody. But according to someone, it's it's like I'm choosing that other person's side instead of that person's side. And I'd be like, what the? F so you get my drift. So 4K, that was me. 5K, we started working. What I mean by that is pencil, paper, notebooks, book bags, usage. Yeah, no naps, no extra recess. Or did we do extra recess? We probably didn't. Um, yeah, and that was when we actually had to learn how to spell our name and do two plus two because unfortunately at that time we thought two plus two was like twenty two or something. We didn't know it was four. <sighs> I kind of miss those days. We didn't think that 9 plus 10 was 21 because at that time, that phrase wasn't even made at that time. Like, the, there was no 9 plus 10 equals 21 or boy, that mean. Uh, yeah. And I'm pretty sure that was in 2010. Yeah, because I was born in 2005. So... It was five-year-old kindergarten. Four, 4K is four-year-old kindergarten. So we have like two types of kindergarten for <laughs> all ages. But it wasn't all ages. It was just um, get smarter, kids. I was still in my shell, but I grew out of it. Thanks to my best friend to this day since I met in 4K and we played Duck Duck Goose and then we grew out of Duck Duck Goose like <laughs> we grew out of tag alright we play like kickball and all that you don't imagine like a 4 or 5 year old playing kickball be like ha boo yay I kicked it like what <laughs> that's that's yeah let me just sum that up for you um and I feel like saying her name like her real name out loud cause like she yeah, her real name's actually Kirsten. And if you watch my uh, special phone call with, with my friend, that is actually who I was talking to on the phone. That uh, was Kirsten. Yeah. Um. She's uh, like I said, she's my best friend to this day, and it's good to have friends from like a long period ago, and still have them to this day. So. Hey, so, um, it's cool, you know, like, I, uh, personally, I, I think that, like, having, like, someone, cause I know, like, for a fact, I have, I know people who, like, they got one friend from, like, five, five, fifth grade, and now they're not friends in sixth grade, like, that's legit a year, alright, y'all could have a friend for a year, a best friend for a year, yeah, y'all get my drift. Having a friend for eight years and still having one when you reach like a different school, getting older, that's good. But as you change, you probably realize, I don't think, yeah. Cause let's just say this, you are in college, you going off to like Duke University in North Carolina, and then somebody else is going to the University of Texas in Texas, y'all gonna fall, y'all gonna fall out, what I mean is that y'all gonna fall out of touch, y'all not gonna call each other every single day, they're not gonna text it every single day, it'll just get shorter, four days a week, shorter, three days a week, shorter, two days a week, shorter, a day a week, and then just, well boom, like, game over, like, <laughs> it's, done then sadly I mean yeah at least I have those great memories and you also have pictures on your phone and stuff but as y'all get older like the world changed I mean hello we got Donald Trump as president <laughs> we got the president who separated kids from their homes I mean okay let's not get into politics I'm sorry back to what I was saying y'all fall out of touch and y'all can't get back in touch unless y'all like go and visit y'all old town.
town or something with our family, and then y'all see each other like public, and be like, oh my god, I haven't talked to you in so long. I mean, trust me, I've, I've, that happened to me before with my mom, but still, it happened to me before. You know, your life changes, alright? Trust me, it's, it's not a good thing sometimes. Like, it's sad, but you know, it's not. It's not like, oh, I'm not being friends with it ever again because you're moving away. It's not like that. Like, whoa. Like, why would we not be friends with somebody else who's just like going away? Like, what? It's not my fault. Y'all going to different universities. Y'all sound different universities, but there's a university that I'm going to, and so is my. Kirsten, what we're playing on so far, but we're still early in our childhood, preteenhood, so we can change our mind like any minute, like, like boom, like that, like that's how fast we can change our mind. So, you know, it's um, it's a process, really, a, a big long process of events that happen in your life and you growing up and you losing friends and gaining friends yeah and let's be honest we're going we're going to a school that's filled with like way more people like our elementary school was little okay it was very very little i mean it only had like 200 people and now at that school it has like 500 people uh from every single six rank elementary school um around us and plus, we get you gain new students like every year, so like it's not um it's not surprising if you if y'all lose touch there. To be honest, yeah, yeah, y'all talk like every day at recess, every day at lunch, boom, yeah, y'all besties forever, and then all of a sudden, boom, you moved on with uh, Samantha, y'all friends or something. Yeah, man, it sucks going on up. That was... But hey, sometimes it's actually worth growing up because like you can drop a car and y'all can go visit y'all friends. But at the same time, you have to pay bills and crap. Like, you gotta get a job. If you don't qualify for a job, like what you gonna do then, huh? What you, what you gonna do then? <laughs> Find another job. But whatever you wanted, only that job. Well, you better change your mind because it don't look like you're going to be getting that job anytime soon. Boom. Logic. Logic sucks. I know. But it's the only thing. Oh, great. We need, if, if there's a scar, okay, there's nothing. I already have a sniper. I'm going to get 500 wood just to get that gold sniper. You know I already have a purple planet. What? So, yeah. That's money. That's that. Um, so, hey, yo, thumbs up this video if you are going to like an older school, like middle school or high school for the first time. Yeah, I know I'm going to middle school for the first time, but I'm talking about it like it's going like off to college or something, but it's really not. It's basically just like your pre college high school drama. Like, it's not. It's not bad at all. You you st <laughs> uh, but yeah. Anyways, back to elementary. First, second, you know, third pass by. Um, I was more out of my shell, so thanks to Kirsten, cause it's all her fault. <laughs> uh, in a good way, or right, in a good way, not like a bad way. In a good way, we make jokes about this, about me being shy like, all the time, and we talk about it's her fault, and so yeah, it's fine. Um, but yeah, I was I help with like my other friends, like my friend Riley, who also has a YouTube channel, uh, Gifted Gamer for Life. I put that in the description, like when I when this video was posted, but I edited it because I have to like fill it out and upload it for my playstation this is what i'm doing this video on and it's gonna be a lot of work because i just using a controller and not an actual keyboard and mouse <sighs> okay 
But yeah, I um, thanks to those friends, I actually have a good childhood so far. And which is um, it's really fun because you don't have to worry about people like, oh, ooh, he's. <laughs> Yeah, we have social media in our lives too, so that also keeps us occupied. Blech. <laughs> like, it keeps us, like, really occupied. Like, it's not even funny how occupied it keeps us. Because it's like, oh. Uh, like, if you can... Like, here's, here's an example. If you have a friend who, you know, for, like, 10 years or something. Don't you think they made you change a little? I mean, let's be honest, okay? I've, I talk a lot more. I, I'm weirder more. Like, I get weird like every single day of school. Even though we're in summer break right now, so I don't have nobody to talk to other than my parents. And I haven't went to an actual sleepover yet other than to somebody's birthday party for a day, but that don't really count because it's for a day. So, you really don't think that they helped you change or anything? Like, oh. Uh, I mean, I ha ha I'm just, I'm just saying, just saying, alright, I am about to. I feel like I'm actually, like, talking about something, like, serious, but in reality, I'm, like, legit, like, barely talking about anything. Because, well, yeah, just, yeah. Because, you know, I, um. Uh... Oh my gosh, okay. So, that's that, alright. Y'all get that conversation, don't y'all? I hope y'all do, because, yeah. <laughs> Y'all get my dream, boy. Y'all get my dream. Oh my gosh. So I'm just gonna just focus on this. Yep. I'm lagging so bad. Y'all probably can't see this, but I'm legit lagging. My internet sucks. Like, for some reason, whenever I record a video, it's like my internet just, like, sucks. Like, more and more. Like, all the time. It's very bad. Like, I can't even kill nobody. My internet is just so trash. Um. But, yeah. Um, that's basically my school experience. It's my elementary experience. Like, it's very, it's really good. It's awesome. Like. <laughs> ah, that dude was, okay, anyway. Sorry. Um. It's awesome, and I, I really love it, and I just... I hope that it doesn't end up, and I'm probably legit about to die. So even if I don't die, I'm still ending this video. So if you guys did, you did give this video a big, big fat machine gun thumbs up. I got it because he used a machine gun to the other day. Anyways, um, subscribe, turn on post notifications so you know when I upload because I upload videos every single day. At least I try to because I have nothing else to do because it's summer break. But when I go back to school, we probably have to work that out. Um, I love you guys. And, uh, I hope y'all have a good, um, school thing later. Or whatever. I might make a school video by the time. Because I go back August 20th, so, yeah. Let me just stop talking. What other, what other thing, what other thing YouTubers say and have a blessed day.